her debate class, okay? And my name is Miss Gunna. Oh, okay. Nice flower. So, does this look spicy? No. No. Yeah. No. No? No? I always eat those. Cookies. Yeah. Okay, but it's quite good. I can Who said yes? Who said yes, it looks spicy? Cricket. 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 Nobody? Okay. But do you think some people may think it's spicy? Yeah. yeah. So why would they think it's spicy? Because it's red. They never look. red? Red? Okay. How about this? No. It's it looks like it's a like like spaghetti. Like okay, but what is this? Spaghetti. Okay. okay. Is spaghetti spicy? No. Only no. no. if you put hot sauce in But like isn't dad. it red? Just like kimchi? Yeah. No, but. Yeah, it yeah. Is, but it's what a is different tomato? sauce. It's a different sauce? Okay, so. Okay. Okay. What is this? Ketchup. You think it's ketchup? Any other guesses? Hot sauce. Yes. Hot sauce? Michael, did you have another guess? No? Okay. Okay, so what is it? Ketchup. 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 But it's actually not ketchup. What? It's hot and spicy flavored tomato ketchup. So it's spicy ketchup. So does the color red always mean it's spicy? No. no. Okay. So how can you tell if something is spicy or not? Yeah? Eat it. You eat it. So we don't know if it's spicy with our eyes. We can only know by tasting, tasting it. So that's practice, okay? When I think of science, I think of bad science. Yeah, let's get a piece of paper. Wait, don't draw it. Don't do anything to the paper yet. Okay. I want everybody to draw a scientist with details like. Do you guys have colors? Crayons? Okay. You can use crayons to color it. What kind of clothes does a scientist wear? What kind of hairstyle? Accessories? What does a scientist look like? Draw a scientist. Suits that work with scientists because the scientists think that like like they need protective clothes from like protect like dangerous chemicals. Okay. And okay. then he's wearing a glove and this stuff. Yeah. Okay. That's it. Nice. Okay. This man. Okay. <laughs> Got a second. Second. So just we have. Who's is this? <laughs> That's mine. Okay, Michael. Um, okay, okay. So on the right side, it's the scientist materials and chemicals okay. and experiments, and then the scientist, like his hair is like a bad scientist, and then his like goggles, goggles and his clothes and everything are from perfection. Safety first. I like that. Okay, now third sign. I can't see because it doesn't really have colors. Whose scientist is this? That is Who's? Rachel! Okay, can you, you want to explain your scientist? This 
scientist. Louder, louder. <laughs> louder, louder. <laughs> the scientist is making a potion. Okay. And he's wearing a suit for protection. And he has regular hair. And he's <laughs> sitting on a chair. And he's making lights. Making lights? For the scientist. Okay, it looks like he's going to uh, <laughs> kill someone with that pencil. <laughs> Who's scientist is this? <laughs> okay. Can you explain your scientist? Um, this Michelle scientist. What is this scientist doing? What is, why does this scientist look like this? <laughs> well, he's testing out a medicine. Okay. Um, and he's wearing um, the white thing, thing that um, suit over that suit over his shirt to protect himself from bad chemicals. And he's wearing like these goggles looking. Things to protect his eyes when there are bad air coming out of the tubes. Mm -hmm. Okay, Michael? Um, the clothes of the scientist on the left side, it has the science mark. Okay, okay. Oh, this one too? Yeah. Um, so question. What is interesting about all of these scientists? They're all different. They're all different? Yeah. yeah. Okay, why do, you think, why do you think they're all different? What makes them different from each other? Uh, because, like, everybody saw different scientists, and then... Okay, but what are some characteristics that make them different? Short, tall, short, tall, short. Okay, so height. style. Okay. SI. Okay, so what makes them similar? Scientists. Yeah? <laughs> They're all scientists. Okay, I don't know they're all scientists, but the traits. What's a similar trait across all of these scientists? Yes? They're wearing things for safety. Okay. Sure. They're all boys. They're boys. Why did you guys all draw boys as scientists? Are there no girl scientists? There is. Yeah. yeah. But I know we're both Wait, wait, wait. Crazy guys, yes, yes. Yes? Yeah, but I most don't. of them are boys. Most of them? Hmm. Who told you that? <laughs> you just know. You just know? <laughs> Who said that most scientists were boys? Hmm. Yes? You want to say something? Yeah, I do that because I draw a boy scientist because I never saw a girl scientist. <laughs> never seen that. Okay. Why, why don't they think, why don't, why did, okay, why do you think you never seen a girl scientist before? No, because you don't know? Because I just don't travel. <laughs> okay. Or see some okay. real scientists. You see, I live under a rock, so I, I never see anything. Yes? Um, the science experiments are usually all dangerous. Okay. And then the boys are like, 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 like better. <gasps> because they're braver and better? Materials, okay. Okay, so why did you choose? Okay, in the beginning I asked, what does a nurse look like? 
And he said, black hair. <laughs> Why do you say that? Because I love you. <laughs> yeah. What? I love you. I love long hair in Korea, so I saw a person more in Korea and all of them are black hair. Okay. <laughs> 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 Michael just said <laughs> this. All right. I think okay. I have some problems. This is our second nurse. Who drew this? <laughs> okay. Okay, Daniel. You want to explain your second your nurse? Sure. Uh, the nurse doesn't always have to be a girl. Why not? Uh, because nowadays. Uh, they are free them to choose what they want to do for their jobs, and I think they choose jobs. Okay, okay. Um, but then why did you draw a girl scientist? <laughs> uh, you never see one. What? I don't know. I never saw one. You never, you never saw one. Okay, but you have you have seen him. Yes. 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 An emergency room. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Let's see the next nurse. <clears throat> Whose nurse is this? Is it Rachel's nurse? I like the very cute hat. Can you explain your nurse? <laughs> okay. That's important. This nurse has a lot of things going on. Whose nurse is this? Okay, Michelle's nurse. Hmm. So why did you draw your nurse like this? Because um, a nurse always wears a proper and neat uniform, and it's, it has um, files um, like to like sort out their patients. Mm -hmm. And it has short hair because I thought like. If so long, it could fly. <laughs> okay, okay. That's a good idea. And our next, last nurse. This is Rachel's nurse. Hmm, Rachel, why don't you draw your nurse like this? Because if the nurse had long hair and it didn't untie it, it would bother its hair from distracting everything. Mm -hmm. The nurse has a hat and a uniform and pants and sneakers and she has a chair and a desk and another small desk to hold her stuff that she'll need. Nice, nice, okay. So what are some similarities and differences between these nurses? Yeah. Just have important outfits. Important outfits. That's a similarity. What else? Mm. Any differences? Yes. They're boy and girl. Okay. There's they're both girls. Okay. That's a little bit different from the scientists. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Why? Why do you think that's different? Well, uh, because in scientists we draw all boys, but then in nurses, I'm the only one who draws boy nurse. Okay, okay. Let's look at the doctor. Mm -hmm. oh, that is mine. <laughs> <They're so tiny. gasps> That's a very tiny doctor. <laughs> Who's that business? Uh, okay. <laughs> Why did you draw a tiny doctor with very big feet? <laughs> <laughs> Can you explain your doctor? The doctor needs one. He needs one with his head. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. And then on the left side, he has a um, um, a doctor board. Okay. And then there's like a nurse on the right side. It's on the two of them. 
Yes. Okay, this doctor. It's very serious. <laughs> Treating the patient, and then if they do like kind of wrong things, like they could injure them battle badly or kill or maybe serious kill them. Okay. And then he had, on his head he had like kind of reflection things that he shoots out the lights and stop fooling the market. <laughs> 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 And then we have like special tools. And yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, thank you. Let's see our next doctor. Okay, this doctor has very dark eyes. Whose doctor is this? Okay. Why did the doctor look like this? I can't remember how I drew it. Okay, you don't remember how you drew it? Um, it has a shot in the hand. Okay. Syringe. Our next doctor is also quite tiny. <laughs> Whose doctor is this? Whose happy doctor is this? Okay, Rachel. Doctors are happy. You don't think doctors are happy? Yeah, they're really happy. Yeah, because they're so serious. Who would like, who would like to see yeah. the doctor who sees sick people every day? Then do you think you'll be happy to see sick people every day? Okay, yeah, you okay, okay. Yeah. So we see Okay, hang on. Do we see happy, happy doctor? Happy doctor, happy doctor, happy doctor. Okay. Who about this one? Oh, we also have another happy doctor. What? <laughs> this doctor. Okay. It has a lot of tools. It has a little stairs and, and I think that's a stapler and a chair. Skateboard? A stapler. 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 Okay, so we have. Okay, what are some similarities and differences? Yes. His, his drawing's being serious and the rest is happy. Okay, okay, so are all doctors happy? No. No. Okay. So you can take a job serious. Okay. <laughs> okay, did you want something to say? Did you have um, everybody's a boy. Everybody's a boy. Mm -hmm. Everybody's a boy. Yes. Um, I have another thing. Yes. He see he said they should be serious, but they can be happy if they're like happy to heal sick <gasps> Okay, so we have some different views. Called a 
stereotype. Has anyone heard of this word before? Hmm, new word. Okay. Does anyone want to read the definition of a stereotype? Okay, I saw Rachel's hint first. Yeah. A well-known idea or image of a person or idea that is held by a number of people. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Boys are louder, always louder, than girls. Yeah. Who thinks this is true? <laughs> you guys think this is true? No, no, no. I yeah. don't think that. You don't think it's true? Okay, why not? Well, some girls can be loud. Yeah, some girls, yeah, like, they, like, so, like, there's a girl in the top. Like, when I was in Korea, there was a tomboy <laughs> and tom girl, and then she was, like, really loud, and then she was, like, oh, he makes troubles. <laughs> oh, sorry, Tom boy, sorry. <laughs> and then and then and then like she always makes trouble and does do her homework and stuff. Mm, okay. Yeah, That's and then like she's like really loud mm. and stuff. Okay. And then she always fight with boys, so Asians are always gonna ask. Who has heard that? Someone say always. I always. No. Okay, not always. Okay, yes. Yeah, I've heard it before. Yeah, what do you think about it? Do you think this is true? Yeah. No, if you're older, when you get older, they... they, they catch up. They okay, they catch up. Okay, okay. That is not true. All blondes are unintelligent. What does this cartoon say? What is the capital of Texas? <laughs> you got it? But how come there be a sausage? What? Oh, there's yeah. this girl in our yeah. class who goes to GMT with me, mm -hmm. and she has blonde hair, and she's really intelligent. So, this is a stereotype. What is a stereotype again? Well, yeah. A well-known idea or an image of a person. Yeah. Yeah. So I say, I see one boy being loud. And then I think, <coughs> all boys are louder than girls. I see some Asians got math. And I say, you know what? I think all Asians are amazing at math. All blondes are unintelligent. So, does anyone think this is true? Yeah. You think that's, that's true? No. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, there's a lot fast, mm -hmm. and then like, and then like, yeah, like, 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 oh god, it's not always, mm -hmm. but some girls who are blonde, like, get to the kind of bad grades, and like, you know. Okay, but can brunettes, brown hair girls, be unintelligent? Be unintelligent? Yeah. If they don't <laughs> study. Okay, does Rachel have anything to say to Daniel? Yeah? Um, what do you think about his comment? What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? I'm asking for your opinion. You want to say something? I don't think all ones are smart. Oh, okay, so you don't think all ones are smart. But all blondes are dumb, right? Is that what you think? Some are smart and some are not smart. Okay, yes? Um, not all the blondes are unintelligent, and, and other color of the hair is like brown, black, and anything else can be like unintelligent too. Whoa, so it's not just blacks? Anybody can be unintelligent. That's a very good point. It doesn't matter the hair color. <clears throat> exactly. All teenagers are rebels. They never listen to their parents. They just do whatever they say. Who thinks this is true? Nobody. Okay, okay. why is it not true? Why is it not true? I think so, so true. So, so true? Okay. Why? So, so true. So you mean this really, really true? Sometimes, yeah. <coughs> I see some teenagers that, like, their parents 
Mm -hmm. And um, some other teenagers listen to what their parents say. Mm, yeah. So all teenagers are not rebels. Yes. They like I like like yeah, like my te my like my neighbor mm -hmm. are teenagers and stuff. So I don't really know that well. Really? Don't know yet. Then I think that teenagers aren't. Rebels because like, like for example, my like Josh, mm -hmm. like he, he lives like right next door. He lives he right next door. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, can you just finish <laughs> my sentence? <laughs> so rude. <laughs> and then, and then, and then he like, he like do lots of chores and like when it always snows, like. Like he creates up the snow, <laughs> snows every time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice. Yes. Some teenagers could be rebels and think think that they're all grown up and think they could disobey their parents and just ignore them because they think they're all grown up and they could do whatever they want. But some people have some teenagers have different different opinions because they still think their um, parents are older than them and they think there's more to learn from them and more to, like, because it's better, because they experience more than them. Yeah, yeah, nice point. Do you know any other stereotypes? Hmm. Any other ideas? Yes. Like, I've heard that, like, like, you know, African Americans mm -hmm. are good at basketball. Ooh, that's a very popular stereotype. Yeah. Any other stereotypes? Mm -hmm. What kind of stereotype did we see here? In this activity? The drawing activity. Like, ooh, yeah. Can I Oh, that's a big one. Yes. Uh, boys can't like pink. Boys can't like pink? Yeah. Like pink is a girl color. <laughs> is that yours? <laughs> pink is a girl color? Yeah. Okay, but there are boys who like pink, right? Yeah. Like, okay, so that's a very good stereotype. They do that a lot in Korea. Does it make you feel mad? <laughs> Is a nerd. <laughs> oh, it's a oh, it's a People with glasses are always so nerdy. Always reading about the same. Any other stereotypes? Mm -hmm. Yes. Popular people are dumb and like like popular people in school. Yeah. They can't do math and is like just not dumb, not smart. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm so popular and you guys can don't even look at me. <laughs> Any other stereotypes? Mm -hmm. uh, um, mm -hmm. What do older people say about younger people? The dumber. Yeah, how does that make you feel? They don't have listen. What? Like it feels like they don't take you at, like seriously. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yes. They say they say that you have no manners. Mm. But is that true? Mm, no. No. no I <laughs> okay. So let's think of some questions. Okay. How true are stereotypes? Not true at all. Okay, yes. Not true at all. Not true at all? Okay, so we have a stereotype. Uh, boys are louder than girls. 
Are there boys like the girls? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, isn't there some truth to some time? There might be. Yeah. Might be? Yeah, but it's not. No. But yeah. why? Okay, why no? You yeah, said, I think you said like, no. Because, like, you know. Why? Like, because, like, if there's a question, like, yeah. For example, the teenagers are rebels. Mm -hmm. Some teenagers could be rebels, while other teenagers could be not rebels and doesn't hurt their parents. Hmm. Okay. So, how true are certain types? What's our conclusion? Agreement. Uh, half true, half false. Okay. So, sometimes. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Sometimes. Uh, sometimes. Okay, so stereotypes are just completely false. Yeah. Yeah. Where did you learn these stereotypes? Who told you? Who in the world told you that all doctors are boys? Who told you that boys are louder than girls? Uh, all teenagers are girls. Who told you that? Where did you learn that? Oh, yes. I figured boys are louder than I figure boys are louder than girls because no one in my class is louder than me. <laughs> okay. okay, you're a boy, so you just beat everybody in the loudest contest. Okay, yeah. And then I remember, like, in Diary of Wimpy Kids, yeah. you know that book? Mm -hmm. Like, from the Gap, the Grass Gap View, like, old teenagers are rebels. Okay. And, like, it, this proves that uh, like you want to send old teenagers to like like army camp and stuff like that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So where else did you learn your stereotypes? You said books. Where else? I didn't. Oh, grown internet. Ups. Hmm. Like grown ups. Grown ups. What do you mean by that? Like like for grown ups, mm -hmm. like like at that time they didn't ask that. Like for like boy and girl job thing, like at that time, like they had like personal jobs, like boy, only boys could play soccer and stuff like that. So okay, okay, yeah, yeah. You could learn stereotypes by actually looking at what, what's happening, and like if you're in a class and you see one boy that's really loud and one girl who's really quiet, you could see that. The boy is louder than the girl. Hmm. Okay. Nice. So, those are called experiences. As you're living, things happen to you and you see those things. And then, you use that as information to make certain judgments or... Overgenerate. And when you, when you have those... Judgments. You see, yeah. So in that example, we see a quiet little girl, little girl, and a really loud, rowdy boy. Then you say, "I think boys are louder than girls." But then it becomes a stereotype when you say, "I think all boys oh. are louder than girls," based based on that one event. What happens to someone if they don't fit a certain stereotype? If they, uh, you see a boy nurse in a large group of girl nurses, what happens if you see a boy playing with a Barbie doll? <laughs> you laugh. You you laughing at the boy playing with the Barbie doll? Why are you laughing? Yeah, but it's because it's like unusual. It's unusual. Hmm. It's not common sense. What do you mean it's not common sense? <laughs> are you saying that I can't play with whatever I want to play? No, it's just weird. It's, it's weird. Hmm. Like no one really does it. Like no one really does that. <laughs> what would you say? It's like you see things from me. I don't think we keep What are you saying? What? 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 No, they're
people want to have that fluid. Yeah, because it's just wrong. Wrong. Yeah, they will take it to the hospital right away. But you said, wait, 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 you guys said that certain types are not true. So, why can't the boy not follow the stereotype of saying all boys have to play with, play with boy stuff and all girls have to play with girl stuff? He said the stereotypes aren't true. So, why can't the boy just wear the bikini and walk down the street in high heels? Yes. <laughs> yeah, for toys, I, you don't get arrested for, like, well, for bikini <laughs> and stuff. It's too much. Too much. It's too much. It's okay, okay. For girls. And then, so, is this too much? <laughs> is this okay? Um, it's not okay. It's not okay. Why do you think this is too much for you? You just can't look at anymore. Oh, me. Why? Why? Oh, um, okay. I'm going to. Yes. I don't suppose to be switch. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's why. Because the stereotype is. All boys love to play with sports and video games and robots. These are boys' toys. But all girls just love to play with doll houses, dolls, mirrors. This is girl toys, and this is boys' toys. But then, you guys said stereotypes are not true. So we switched them. But then Daniel said, Oh, I can't see. I can't see this. Can you move a piece of this page? Why? Why do you feel I feel disgusted? Huh? Why do you feel disgusted? Uh, I feel disgusted like because when I when you talk about stereotypes, I keep on thinking of the <laughs> <laughs> bikini. <laughs> <laughs> but what is so wrong about that? <laughs> yeah, because oh, <laughs> because nowadays. Now the word I'm saying is that a woman is not wearing Excuse me, can you please let me finish my sentence? My papa! My papa! Yes, 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 Michael. Um, so, it's like unusual. It's unusual. Mm. Okay. So you guys think this is not okay. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, oops. <clears throat> anyway, this is called gender bias. This is discrimination against someone based on their gender. You are sort of discriminating this guy and this girl because you're saying, you have to do what you're supposed to do. Whatever that's supposed to do is. So this is called gender bias. Is this okay? Yes. That's okay. Why is that okay? It's not just a little. It's just a little. Okay. Is this okay? <laughs> is that a man with a long hair? No, it's a woman. No, <laughs> woman it's not a woman. A woman in a suit, a man in a dress. Um, uh, a woman she's okay. okay. She's okay? Yeah. <gasps> okay, so... Yeah, because a woman can be a policeman. Oh, yeah, a woman can go to businesses. Oh, wait, hang on. Is this fair? Girls can do more things, <coughs> more boy things, than... <coughs> Boys doing more girl things? Why do we have different, it, different it, expectations? Is that for cooking? No, that's not for cooking. <laughs> <laughs> not an expert, but uh... <laughs> boys can cook. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. I can. But is this is a cook cook. Is this fair? It's not fair. No. It's not fair. It's not fair for the boys. It's not fair for boys. Yeah. Why would boys want to wear a girl dress? It's just plain. Because everybody's oh, like, oh, it's okay. No. No. Hercules is a girl. Yes? <laughs> you guys think this is too much? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Why? I think it's true. Princesses are supposed to be polite and like, no, princesses, not twins. Don't have to be pretty and princess doesn't and need to be pretty. You could just bore a princess and be ugly and rude. <laughs> okay, so you're saying that stereotypes, the stereotype of pretty polite princess, <coughs> is not 
always true. Yeah. yeah. So, this is okay. Yeah, this is okay, but it's just mm -hmm. long. Like, I just can't see it. Like, the gender <laughs> should be different. Gender should be different. And that, that picture of the sort of the kid is like, okay, I'm wearing a like, like yeah. 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 You guys think that it's okay to not fit a stereotype sometimes <laughs> because you can be Asian and not be good at math. You can be uh, a girl and be a longer than a boy, but a boy trying to be a princess is not a no. not... So we learned about stereotype, bias, prejudice, and discrimination. That's a lot of words, but I'm going to clarify them. What does it say? Define <coughs> race by race. Okay. Breaking news. Breaking news. Crying race, race by race. race. What does the chicken say? <coughs> oh my cat people oh, have high speed. The chicken got some information. Some facts. Yes, it is true. Cat people have the highest rate of crime. What's what cat people? The cat species. Now, search it. What does it say? All cat people look very dangerous. Yes. Okay. The chicken found some information and then said, <coughs> All cat people must be very dangerous. That is a stereotype. <coughs> Bias. OMG, look who is here in my store. Who is this? Cat people. And what does the chicken think? <coughs> all the cat people, people are dangerous. All cat people. Yeah, bias, the tendency um, to think only in, in one point of view. What is the chicken's point of view? He thinks the cat people are dangerous. Yeah, yeah, the, cat, yeah the chicken thinks that all cat people are dangerous. Look, that's the only thing that the chicken thinks. Prejudice. What does the cat say? When he's staring at me, I'm only in the Prejudice is a very bad attitude about a certain group, cat people, because of a stereotype and because of a bias. Oh yeah, that happened. Yeah, what do you mean? Like, you know, you know the Pearl Harbor, a bad Japanese plane attacking Virginia and stuff? Like, after that, the president made the older Japanese people go to the army camp. Very good historical example. Yeah. So the president had a stereotype of saying, okay, that thing, that information, information of the um, bombing happened. So the president thought, okay, all Japanese people must be dangerous. That's a stereotype. Because that's not always true. That's not true. But then the president showed prejudice, negative attitude. Whenever the president saw a Japanese person, what did the president think? Yeah, me ears. Exactly. <coughs> Discrimination. What does the chicken do to the cat? The cat. Yeah. Yeah, out of my store. But did the cat actually do anything? No. no. I just wanted to stop. Yeah, exactly. You just wanted to buy chickens. <laughs> no, the discrimination. This is negative, bad action, behavior against a certain person or group because of prejudice, because of stereotypes. And bias. <coughs> yes. But if one person, like, for example, if somebody did something and they and they were like Chinese or something, why couldn't they? Why why couldn't a person just like kick out the person that did something wrong instead of the whole every single Chinese person, just the person who did something bad? Bias. Bias, remember? I said it is not you only look at one point of view. <coughs> this chicken only sees cat people as evil. It does not see any other normal cat person as nice. This is bias. It only has one point of view. So in your example, they don't see any nice uh, people. They only see bad people. <coughs> That's why they show prejudice and discrimination. So, you guys learned about a lot of important things for homework on Wednesday. I want you to I want you guys to look up 
You should. You guys should write this down so you remember. If you need paper, I can give it to you. If you need paper, to remember it. Okay. Okay. I want you guys to write down the words stereotype, bias, prejudice, and discrimination. And just like for political correctness, try to find a comic or picture on Google Images to represent each term. Any questions?